I will read the story of Korean about the pilot and the little prince in the desert to learn about Vietnamese and or emphasize the English speaking skills. And this time, Korean in English. I use Zoom it. Now, let's read here. The pilot and the little prince uh, together. Traveled through the desert, showering stories and wisdom. The pilot learned. knew about the uh, adventure of uh, the Legend Princess uh, on different planets or many planets. The encounters of uh, strange characters such as uh, the consists loads and the wide box and this research on meaning and understanding in the vast universe. Okay, this story is about uh, the content in Korean. I'll leave it in English. Now, I talk about Korean uh, grammar and the pattern of Korean with uh, using the four type of uh, um, words and the, these are simply nouns, verbs, adjective, and adverb. They are meaningful words with the letter. And the other part is the grammar pattern, like uh, which frequently used words such as uh, pronoun, preposition like Josai in Korean, and What else? Mm. Conjunction. Yeah, some kind of uh, grammatical words. Here and then. Wow. And then for subject. Object. Lul. The little is also the <clears throat> never uh, described form. This uh, blue one is uh, frequently used, uh, repeated. So just knowing about that, all the Korean words combined with this kind of uh, some josa and then grammatical expression and about the tense and then so when you learn Korean language, you just combine the with the words in the sentence. The point is what frequently use the words combined with the main words like noun, verb, adjective, adverb. That is the point. So 
to know about that, understanding about just simply kind of language like Korean. I think uh, every language has a, a group. They have a unique pattern, English and Vietnamese or Chinese and Thai, uh, Thai language and uh, Korean and Japanese. I don't know many about there are in, 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 in the world, many languages, but these languages are grouped in terms of blue. The, it's the same as English, Korean, Vietnamese with the noun, verb, adjective, adverb, it's all the same. But the difference is how to express combined in the sentence with using these four main words with the grammar. Some, for example, pronoun as this is a common, and then conjunction, this is a common, and then but other parts like a preposition or article or singular and plural and the tense uh, is a different. Each language has, a, they have their unique uh, pattern. If you understand that, maybe it's very easy to learn any languages because they are group the similar one, but um, just it's about, I mean, it's about uh, this, about uh, uh, text, written language. Spoken language is another thing because uh, there are pronunciation. Pronunciations are unique with the tonation and just some, even though and then if we are familiar with that kind of pattern, we uh, better, better understand about it. As you can see, Korean language, Korean uh, language has uh, combined with uh, this blue. If you understand the blue, you click. And then you don't have to learn about the blue because uh, while you're learning about Korean language, these pattern frequently repeated. Um, so and then it's it's a matter of what to use, what the order like uh, is simple, and then not a big deal. The Korean language is very. Um, complex one to learn. But I think if you get familiar with it, uh, blue, you can learn Korean languages better, quickly. But the point about the red one, this is uh, just the vocabulary. Vocabulary, for example, um, and some of the words are nouns. Some of the words are adjective. Some of the words uh, are verb, and some of the words uh, are adverbs. Mostly, and uh, nouns are more in the sentence, eh? and adverb as uh, so verb or uh, adjective are uh, one, and then adverb here. So and then uh, the simple you can learn Korean. After reading how to read, after learn how to read Koreans, and then and you learn uh, vocabulary, uh, many ways to learn vocabulary. Just so you can learn with the vocabulary book, you can learn listening and reading something, reading book and finding in many ways. And simply, anyway, this red is just only vocabulary. The blue is the point. Blue is, uh, you don't have to blue. 
you don't have to learn about the blue in detail because these blues frequently use the form, repeatedly use the form. So, and then you are aware about, for example, the so, and conjunction described and about the law, like subject, object, or the tense and the pattern of verbs called the sorcerer and like in English preposition, some and pronouns, that kind of. And in Korean, compared to English, there's no article of the, and then also the plural is not straight, it's simple. I'll leave it about the Korean and hope to learn easily.